There's only anti-chase, any chance. I mean, there's, there's boards that can beat it. Just just not Cloud Sword Unrestrained. I mean, Cloud Sword Unrestrained theoretically could if you were going first. But it's like pretty, uh... It's pretty slim odds. This hand sucks. I probably shouldn't have even combined this, to be honest. I don't even know if I'm sticking around. I haven't decided what I'm doing. Musician? I haven't actually played the Musician Healer board before. I could try that. Play it the first time. So it doesn't do anything? Ah, as in the second time you play it, you need to have extra hexagrams. So you're saying, like, the second time you play the Drag Moon, it requires another hexagram. Is that what you're saying? Am I understanding correctly? I'm not a musician. I haven't actually played Musician however very much. Yes. Okay. Okay. I, I have you. I got you now. Now I understand where you're coming from. That, that'd be interesting. It would certainly make it a little bit more reasonable. It means you wouldn't have that just, like, endless... Endless uh, damage. Yeah, okay, I'm kind of into it. I wish my board sucked less. I guess I picked Musician. I'll probably just roll on two and try to make a healer Tanshi on board and then go from there. Mostly ignore Legendaries. They still got back to my flank. Smallish loss. Kind of not great to be starting on Energy Destiny, but it's whatever. Delete what's that? I mean, we can dream, right? I don't think I really want a Spirit Team. Earth Tune, whatever this card is called. I'm not a coward. I'm missing the thing that actually rewards me for playing all of these cards. Namely the formation. Maybe I, maybe I wanted that kindness too. <laughs> Cutting weeds first. It doesn't do anything either way. Because I can't put it before flank. What I'm mostly looking for is stillness at Adama. Bunch of stillness at Adamas, please. The musician cards are not incredible for this. Not early anyway. Obviously the later they come into their own. Man, I love only traces. I probably should have kept horse. Horse is probably better than cutting weeds. That's the wrong song. Uh, I'm not going to look at any of that. Let's just draw a card. Okay, there we go. There's the boy. I'll take an upgrade to this, sure. Legion Chin Birdie went. It's a thing. Um, I should probably still be rolling to upgrade the the tunes. Now this is a cutting weeds board. Hey, don't reduce my max HP. <laughs> That's my thing. I'd love a rejuvenation. I don't know about Birdie Wind, but I would love a rejuvenation.
I also wouldn't hate some, like, internal injury, but level 2 cutting moves will get the job done. Imposings. Alright, let's break through. The only things I'm looking for on this tier are, like, more imposings and illusion tunes. But we can find, like, Revitalize and Chi Therapies on 3, which seem way better. I really don't like any of these. Let's refresh. I also don't really like any of these. It's not a water drop erosion game. Bodybuilding? I remember having a discussion once about whether bodybuilding was better than Birdie Wind. I kind of like... I kind of go back and forth. I still sort of like... I sort of, I still sort of hate Birdie Wind. <laughs> so, I'm on team, uh, I'm on team bodybuilding. I was hoping for, like, a rejuvenation or some card draw, but I think what we can get, I guess. He's also an illusionist, uh, a musician, sorry. We have a lot of good hits on this tier. Uh, obviously revitalized and, uh, Revitalize and Chi Therapy are the two big ones. We don't have as much on tier 4 other than our song that we're looking for, the uh, regen tune, which is probably enough that I don't want to roll here if I don't have to. I'm sure I'm good at drawing imposing though. I'd really rather be rolling on 4 when I can find an upgrade to my song. Maybe I just roll my side job card every turn. I kind of don't hate that. No. I'll see you in hell, cutting weeds. I mean, this is probably perfect. <laughs> This was the plan, and we are executing it. The cut weeds have been weed cut, something like that. I wonder if I should put the weaker in posing after the uh, only traces. Oh, chi for me. Everyone gets some chi in this fight. Enemy Tantrion, you're going to take a thousand damage here. Wait, cutting weeds. <laughs> okay, you're not going to take quite a thousand. Stupid cutting weeds. Betraying me. It's minus seven degrees, dude. I'd love to give you some heat. It is nightmarishly hot here. Jade Vase. All right, is this a drag moon board? We could combine imposings and run drag moon. I'm kind of not a drag moon believer. <laughs> I'd easily draw everything for this board. This has been a very, very good run. Um, finding all these imposings, stillness and revitalized. Uh, I mean, we've gone whole games not maxing imposings or not finding a level two Citadama. So we're doing well, we're doing well. She's got Jade Vase as Wurzer, which is honestly criminal. Like, that should definitely be against the law. Also very funny that she also has a Revitalized.
This is a bit closer than I would have liked. Uh, we still take a decent chunk out of her. <laughs> She'll draw an imposing. Wow, we could have had two drag moons. Um, we'll just take Avatar. I think Avatar's fine. Side job cards are also tempting, but I like having Avatar on this board. Being able to play double... Well, do I... Is it better than two side job cards? It might not be. I, th I think it is, though. This board does have an issue here. It does not gain any max HP. Doesn't gain any max HP, which means we are a threat of just being flying fanged into oblivion. Lucky I've got my body building. Lucky, lucky this uh, Tension has been working out. I don't know if I should ditch the Sky Spirit tune. Maybe not. Ujubi's on tier 5. We're hoping. Although the thing we're really looking for is regen tune. So I'm going to keep rolling my side job card every turn at least. It would have been nice to have a chi therapy, but, you know, beggars and choosers and whatnot. <laughs> Look at those eyes. <laughs> Your thoughts only, please. Ow. I bet he wish he died there. Imagine how much better his life would be if he died to that last rejuve. I take 24, Bozo. Oh, this region tune. Okay. <laughs> this game's easy. I mean, now I'm just looking for things on tier 5. I'm looking for Great Spirit and... Um, chase into the stillness. Hey, Jolly you, you got it, buddy. Welcome, welcome to the team. Sky Spirit Tune is fine. It might do something against some of these people. <laughs> You've already never had enough cheese on the fly. I believe in you. Hey, Breakbill TV. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. I'm wondering if I just ditch the Sky Spirit tune. I should probably hold it. So we do need one more Citadama. And Julie Wynn, thanks as well. I mean, enjoying the the contributions to the channel, uh, to the uh, the Discord channel for the UCN. Good to have you here as well. Um, <laughs> it's all good. I mean, you, you you see me post in the Discord, right? Like it's it's fine. You'll 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 know. So regen tune is the the big appeal of this. That and being able to anti chase, but regen tune is pretty cruel. It means now we've got this like nice big max HP pool. Obviously, upgrading it would be great. The anti chase stuff's a bit weird because it often hurts you more than it hurts your opponents. But sometimes it's the only way to win fights. Oop. Build sure came online quickly. I might not be able to beat like Wutsu nonsense. It's our battle of fate and it's good result really. I think I'm gonna keep re just rolling side job cards. Lake hacks. I don't really need lake hacks. This tiger has some applications. I'm not going first. Just gotta change the catastrophe and stuff. Mechi! I think I'll just run this board. I do get a little less healing now that I'm only playing one Citadama, but it should be fine. I, they're just not gonna have Battles of Fate. I assume, but yeah, it'd be it'd be nice to have this in some capacity. I just wish the reward wasn't something that reduces variance. Maybe you in the Battle of Fate you get like a treasure or something. That'd be cool. 
If you play regen tune and anti-chase, how does the board function? Um, there's a couple of ways you can do it. You can either just play regen tune and a bunch of like the cards that actually heal you, like Great Spirit and um, Escape Lands, or you can just play the Citadama without the regen tune. Yeah, I also think it'd be nice if the loser of Battles of Fate got something. Like, I think it's fine that you want to win them, but it'd be nice if there was some sort of, like, compensation for losing. So I think we outraced this Flame Flutter without too much difficulty. Would be nice to upgrade the Revitalize to kill a little bit faster. Yeah, it'd also be nice to have the damage system function a little bit more smoothly. Alright, you should have died sooner, rat. <laughs> yeah, that'll pop Crimson Yarn Guard, alright. Oh, nice. Improvement. Mine card breakthrough, we're not quite there. Another fly. I mean, this is just a placeholder. And I'm pretty sure I'm always playing Chi here. It's so awkward to fit this in, and it does so little. And the damage is basically irrelevant. It's not worth the seventh of a card. How do how you, you take flame? I mean, I can explain it if you want. <laughs> I can't explain why that's a thing, but I can explain it. <laughs> I suspect you're being I suspect you're being sarcastic. All right, will this Wurzer find? Uh, Tier 5 more She's not playing a very good board. Like, she's not playing any of the good gold cards. So I kind of want to ditch this Sky Spirit tune. Tiger. I don't know. I mean, I think I win this fight as it currently sits. So let's not change too much. I wouldn't have gone first anyway. That is a max hexagram formicide, by the way, on tier 3. So that's, um, scary. That could certainly beat us. Wouldn't you rather play two separate ones on this tier? I like seeing Tiger. Jesus, that is a kind of insane board. Am I going to lose to Escape Plan? My board chases better than hers, right? I mean, I might lose to just taking damage, but I don't think I lose to escape plan. I kind of struggle to out heal her, though. Alright, we, we win this unless the fight goes to time, which it might. God damn it, we lost because of time. <laughs> that was brutal. <laughs> what a brutal way to lose. Let's get this out of here. I could just take Cut Off the Mundane here. Is that a I don't even need Regi. Let's just take Cut Off the Mundane. And try to... I don't have a card to roll. <laughs> Still don't have a card to roll. Fuck off! I <laughs> don't have cards to roll. <laughs> um, shit. I might need predicament. Do I just burn three rolls here? I don't really want to roll an imposing. I can't play my board though. Like, I have too many continuous cards. Alright, I guess I'm just burning. Burning a roll. I wish I had kept. I wish I had kept my other imposing then. 
Playing a normal attack on this board feels pretty bad. It's more that I don't want to lose, like, a fight right now that I should have won. Splitting cards right now would definitely be nice. I mean, we're going to win this easily. Totally doesn't matter that our last card's a normal attack. So, regen tune upgrade is the main thing that uh, I would like. <laughs> Roll to luck, whoops. <laughs> How embarrassing. You took max damage from a board with normal attack. Oh, that's a good card. The escape plan, that is. Confusion? Confusion's a card. Grand Rivers is a little scary. Everything I draw, I'm like, oh, that's a card. That's a real card. I don't think Confusion is a card I'm playing. I think I can roll that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you're right. Should probably just chase that through. I guess I can bind the imposings and play the prop. This still being level one kind of sucks. This rupt sprite is interesting. Is it actually good anywhere? Not really, I'm just gonna roll it. Chase, chase, chase. This predicament looks pretty bad, huh? Floating Chain's a fine chase. I would rather have uh, great spirits, but it's fine. We had to be going second against Wu Jingzhu. Ow. Oh, that punishes me pretty hard. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that's a bit of a punish. I didn't know he was a musician. I knew it was a possibility. This is very funny that this is the turn that I, uh, will chase. <laughs> Pretty rough. At least I'm doing stuff. It could be worse. Like, his board's not great. Now it's out to take max damage, yeah. A little bit. A little bit like that. Yeah, almost. Strike twice is good. Region chain upgrade's great. <laughs> My, how quickly we learn. I can strike twice the Citadama if I want. I could also anti chase her. This is generally going to get better than Prop Omen. It's kind of a possibility. But it's not really where I want to be. That's not. This 
this even better than only traces? I'm not sure it is. No, 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 I, 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 know, I know it is. <laughs> it's okay, don't worry. I, I figured it out. But we keep the only traces for the avatar, right? This is theoretically a good board for me. Like a good matchup. My board's pretty scary though. So we'll see. My cards are a little unupgraded. Ah, uh, she runs out of chi hard, doesn't she? I'm glad she runs out of chi. That makes my life easier. Okay, her needing to waste turns here probably seals it. Also, this Revitalize doesn't really need to be here for this matchup. This should just not be a matchup where I'm playing Revitalized. I should just be trying to outlast. Not that it matters here, really. Like, we overkill her by a million from full health. We, we may deal 36. Maybe not. None of these do anything. I've already got a strike twice, and it's not a particularly high priority to upgrade. <laughs> uh, I'll take another regen tune and try and max it. It's a good pickup. What are, you, what are you doing exactly? One, two, three, Lotus. So like Lotus here makes me want to just play this, I think. Though, do I eventually start dying to Moonshades? Might just start dying to Moonshades, but like, there's a Lotus here, right? Could extremely suspicious. It's a bit spooky. I want all of these cards. I'm not being a very good Tanshi on at the moment. Maybe I don't need this only traces. Hmm. Strike twice is really good in like very specific matchups. Which there's not really a lot of yeah. Strike twice. Um that's a really hard question, Leo Panther. Her former side boards are good because when they get fully online. Um they're kind of insane. Oh, I wish people would stop doing that to me. Crazy for rolling the strike twice, perhaps. Um, her board, her former side board's really good once it all comes uh, online. It's just it's a lot worse when it's not online. Yeah. I just don't know what to do, Senpai. <laughs> like, I, I sympathize. I just don't know what to do. <laughs> so his board's worse now. He does have a maxed Moonshade, which is kind of terrifying. Just means I keep taking a shitload of damage. His board slows down a lot, 
But these turns are so rough. <laughs> It's very funny that my, uh, that my regen tune is keeping him alive. It's like I'd probably lose this, this turn. Yeah. That was tough, because I couldn't revitalize because of the stupid frozen blood lotus. Okay, we maxed the regen tune, so that's good at least. Cheat therapy a little late to the party. I need Illusion Tune. All props are good. This board looks not very strong. I have to figure out some other way to beat this. Maybe Strike Twice is the Strike Twice is the answer. I don't think it's Escape Plans. I guess Predicament is maybe good here. Maybe I have to find a way to beat him with Predicament. The Extremely Suspicious seemed not good. Seemed not great. I definitely don't need a hundred of these. This board is also kind of scary. So this is scary. She is not scary. He's scary. That's not scary. It's not scary. So it's really just these two. This board is kind of insanely good against me. We're gonna have to really figure something out there. It's probably just regen tune predicament. And then we go from there. I'm just gonna take this combine. So yeah, former side kind of doesn't come together until late, and then very often it finds itself in a position where it's not really capable of like killing people on turn four, and you just don't have like any tech that you can bring in to solve that problem. Whereas this board has a lot of like flexibility with what you can do, which I think is its main strength. Like this board is not like super optimized. It's very good. That's rude. Um, maybe I need a side. Maybe that's how I beat that guy. Um, like this board is very good, but like I haven't like maxed my great spirits, you know? Like, this former sideboard that doesn't have five thunders, like, it just can't do anything. Like, it's just incapable of dealing damage. <laughs> so, like, it's just so dependent on those hits. You know, and I've got, like, a maxed escape plan, but if I was still playing, like, my, um, imposings and stuff, like, it'd be fine. Pretty rude that she's always going to skip that Great Spirit. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Alright. We're up against El Tigre. One, two, three, four, five. This board doesn't look great. Get the props in this. This is a board I can maybe just outlast. Like escape plan's really annoying for him. Then I could run double escape plan. The problem with that is. Is there a problem with that? Does that just work? Well I just win if I do this. Hey, Toshimaru. There is a bit of a problem with this Vigorous getting bigger and bigger. Kind of feels like this wins. This is still a problem. <laughs> this is still an issue. And this is... A smaller issue, but certainly still an issue. I 
Maybe I anti-chase him and don't play regen Tian. He has concentrate elements, but it's going first. I could also combine the Great Spirits and play a chord. I think I'm fine here. <laughs> Thanks, Tatar. I think double escape land will be too good. And I'll just out heal him. It's a bit of a bold call. Because if I'm wrong, I'm going to take a million damage. But... Probably not wrong, right? Like, I should heal all this damage up. I think not defense is kind of funny. It actually works out badly for him. <laughs> okay, I think now we just have God up forever. And we just outscale him with the Great Spirits. That's not true. I do take a big hit here. But we heal it back up real fast. Okay, we're approaching double his HP. I'm going to declare myself the winner. That was a good hit. I went down to 390 for a second there. Okay. This fucker. <laughs> I still don't think I'm HHH. side him. So he goes one, and then we can side the Moonshade. It's fucking Sword Bamboo. Uh, I kind of don't want Regen Tune. Or do I? Uh, that side is nasty. Because I sort of want to anti-chase him, right? Anti-chase also good. This is really tough. I don't know if this wins. I never deal damage again. Which is probably too bad. This is probably wrong. God, this is... Ugh. I have to think this one out. I don't think siding does anything. Turn. That's very funny. Also, we get entangled. Not ideal. The declaration that I'm just not going to take damage is pretty brazen. It's pretty brave. <laughs> it's probably too brave. <laughs> like, this side does nothing. That didn't chase, which is funny. But <laughs> it's also kind of bad. <laughs> I think we just lose from, like, random scalings. This time I side Space Spirit Field. That's not great. Yeah, I need to probably anti-chase him. Now I'm just always siding that. That's not, not very good. 
Definitely not the card I wanted to land on always siding. Side seems like not it. It's just this fucking guard up. Like this guard up makes my life so hard. It means the easy out of just like out of just like killing him doesn't work. This guy's obviously anti-chasing, so. That makes my life difficult in new ways. I don't really think side is a it's a fucking million of these. Maybe this needs to be earlier. I don't know, it's a lot of healing. Like, you can sometimes get him with this. Yeah, I mean, it's a bunch of chases that still just do a lot, right? <laughs> this, like, does randomly beat Mono Water sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't, like, enough damage with your Revitalized when it's maxed. I would say it's unlikely, but it's not zero. Close to zero, though. A max copy of Great Waves is pretty rough. Nah, unfortunately, I think we're dead. Rough matchups in the last, in the finals. Two, uh, two really hard ones to beat for us. They're just These two just have not lost Destiny in like four rounds. <laughs> these two just did not lose any Destiny in like a couple of rounds. <laughs> 